Hello everybody, welcome back. We just finished taming our new friend. Name is Nighthawk. Uh, I'm going to take a following. Passive. Um, yep, that's about an exchange. So, thanks to the taming bonus, it became level 71. I'm going to go ahead, put the saddle on. And before I take off, I'm going to steal some stuff from this beaver. Oh, they only have cementing paste and mushrooms. Okay. Like, all that wood it would be really good if you have high amounts of weight, but I don't, so. Oh, uh, this feels nice. Just being able to fly up, go anywhere pretty much you want. So, the controls for this would be... Um, C is to do that, the little spinning spiral attack, at least for default controls, I think. I don't remember changing anything. Um, spacebar just to land, and E is, no, no, spacebar again is to take off. Yeah. You would be getting off, so. Um, I want to land on top of the base just to be safe. food in there. Now that's going to be leveling up like a hundred times before we even get to use her a lot so that's a good thing. I just need to get some metal to repair my pike. Um, okay. it I create a fishing rod by the way. For those of you that have been wanting to fish I just haven't actually gotten the chance to do it because in the single player I was not able to collect enough anchor points to spend it on this. There was other things I needed to do. Um, okay. So we're gonna go ahead and I'm just gonna put some material away because we like being organized. Um, Throw that in there. Cementing paste. Oops. Okay, so there's two things I got. While taming, I leveled up, and because of that, I was able to. Um, shoot, I need more hide and wood. Okay. I was able to um, get the engram for a long neck rifle which is pretty much like a sniper. So we're gonna go see if we can make that. Uh, actually before I repair, let me check how much I need. 95, okay, never mind. <laughs> we're not gonna be making that this video. Uh, for next video, I will have this ready to be used and we'll try it out. But, okay, we, do we have anything else? No, we don't. How much do we need for ammo? Two and twelve gunpowder. Gunpowder is not hard to make. I believe I've showed you guys already it, but just in case you didn't watch those, it takes one spark powder and one charcoal. Really simple, quick to make. <coughs> uh, let's put this back here. I got a chair because you need to use the chair for the fishing, um, for the fishing rod. I don't know where to put it. I think I'm just gonna put it on the coast right here. Or, we do have a raft. I don't I probably should ask him before if I can use it, but. For now, I'll just put the chair on this. So if I sit, okay, yeah. That works, okay. Um, now let's go ahead and let's go ahead and fly. We're gonna go ahead and get some airdrops because it's probably the easiest thing to do. Oh, already leveled up. So what I've been thinking about what the best thing to do is. Apparently, the Trandons are really good attackers because of that spiral attack. 
However, I do need a good way to like move around and get places. So I think I'm gonna do stamina. Actually, stamina's good. It's 450. That's pretty high. Um, melee damage. I think I'm gonna do melee damage and movement speed then. Um, yeah. I'm gonna do me melee damage and movement speed just so I can move around and get places quicker. Let's go. Oh, there's no good airdrops around. Okay, well, whatever. Let's go to the white one. I mean, it's better than nothing. But my main goal now would be, I guess, to gather metal to make that rifle. Plus, the tribe leader does have the flak armor. So I can go ahead and make that pretty easily. Um, I'll just get the metal for him and he can craft it for me. Okay. Anything else? Nope, not much else. Let's go ahead. Uh, for those of you first time watching these videos and have never actually seen any gameplay of the game I'll go to the green obelisk over here show you what it is and You know just to let you guys know what it is Basically though, it's used to oh god Why are the frames dropping so much? Okay, um, basically it's used to um, summon the three bosses in the game However, I think in the last major update, which was just like, I think two weeks ago or something, they introduced the um, cross server transfer with it. Meaning that you can um, use it to teleport into different maps. So you can go to the center and go to Scorched Earth using the obelisk and then come back. Um, they did say that you can bring items over from there but you cannot take items with you. So you can go to Scorch Alert from the island, you know, have fun there and then come back with items, but you just can't take over like all your gear. So you're basically starting over there. Um, okay, we, we need to land. Oh, there we go. When you run out of stamina, they just go straight down wherever you are, so try to be in a safe area, make sure not to be in water. Last time I tamed one of these, I was gonna record it, but then I tamed it. I flew, touched the water, and went straight into the water and died. So do not go near, anywhere near water. <laughs> okay, let's go see if we can do this. I'm really hoping it doesn't teleport me because I don't want to go there just yet. I just wanted to show you guys what it's all about. Oh, there's a dead person here. Wow. Um, I feel bad, but I think, I mean, this is a PVP VE server, so we can't take things from people if we wanted. I do feel bad though. Wait, I can't, uh, okay, I can't take the hunter hat skin for some reason. Actually, I have a feeling that this guy was also trying to show it and got teleported, but, so I'm not going to actually click on that, but I'll explain what happens. Um, before the update, when you click on it, you would have the option like to summon all three of the bosses. You would have an inventory where you put your... Um, you'll have an inventory where you can put all the items required to do the summoning. And then, once you do the summoning, you'll get... Uh, I never summoned the boss, so I don't know, but it summons something. Journeyman's Long Neck Rifle. 
tranquilizer dart is equipped, sucks I don't have bullets. But now that I have this, <laughs> I really do feel bad. Um, what's trank darts? Okay, it's for knocking things out. Oh, that was kind of obvious, I guess, from the name. <laughs> um, I've never even heard of these darts, though. Okay, well, that is fine. We're gonna... Actually, I'm not gonna waste the darts. I'm gonna go and make some bullets, because we have ammo. I mean, we have enough metal for that. Um... If I can remember where our base is, I don't actually remember where the base is because I can't see anything. I'm gonna have to go low. Oh shit. Please don't disconnect me. Okay. Oh, nope, nope. Shit, I got it. Ah, uh, come on. Okay, I know I'm like oh, somewhere on this side, so I'm just gonna keep going over here and eventually I'll find it. Wait, no, I've never seen an area like this. Crap, I'm lost. <laughs> oh, what the hell? I'm all the way over there? Okay, um, so how, which way do I have to go? I'm gonna have to go... oh... This way? Yeah, this way, okay. Yep, sorry about that guys. Um, I guess I'm just not very good at directions. <laughs> um, for this server though, the night time is, I believe, slower. I mean, faster. It's like 50% the time uh, usually is by default, I believe. I could be wrong. I'm actually gonna... Oh god! Follow me. Oh uh, my god, I'm an idiot. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, that was so close. <laughs> oh my god. I was so scared there. I thought I was going to die and lose everything. <laughs> okay. Yeah, what I was going to do was turn this off because I don't want others to see me. And it's... Oh my god. Okay, so I have to keep going down to the right, okay. I know where we are now. I should be able to find my way back. But, I'm sorry for that. <laughs> I'm sorry for how dark it is. I know when I post this on YouTube later, it will be hard for you guys to see anything. Um, there's not much I can do about that because the server does not allow the gamma. Um, to be used, so I can't change that. I don't own the server. I could try asking them. Maybe if they think that it might be useful, they'll allow it. But I believe that in the last patch they did um, introduce something called night vision goggles. So uh, whenever that gets unlocked by our level, we can make that and use it. Hoping it's not for Scorched Earth only because I don't have that yet. Wait, I think I see a base over there. One sec, let's grab this. Oh no. Okay. That keeps happening now. 
Let's grab this blue airdrop quickly. Um, why can I not grab it? Oh, there we go. Ooh. Uh, I think I already have a compass. Okay. Is that a base? There's something over there. Let's go check it out. I mean, might as well. <laughs> oh no, it's just a bird. Never mind. Okay, so I'm just gonna keep on heading back to our base and Next time we're going to test out this rifle and see what else we can tame. I'll see you guys next time.